hello welcome to my channel this is the first video i'm doing so today is december the third and it's the beginning of mox week so we had inset day on monday but now first day of school back to school ready to smash this so i'm just currently eating my breakfast i have some porridge and i'm just eating that at the moment and then afterwards i want to finish getting dressed because as you see i don't have my tie on and stuff and this morning i'm going to leave early because i have an exam first module biology so i do combine science so the paper's one hour and ten minutes been revising like all yesterday and i just hope to do good on it so i'm going to quickly eat my breakfast and then i'm going to get ready and i'm going to try and leave early to get to school so i don't get to school late and then miss the exam seven minutes later so i'm now finished the time's about 7.09 and when I finish getting dressed and then after I finish getting dressed I'm gonna go over my biology flashcards that I made yesterday it's just on like enzymes and cells and just the basics like that and then afterwards that's all I'm gonna do I'm gonna brush my teeth then get wash my face and then I think okay, I'll be ready so to just finish my breakfast so right now my desk is looking like a mess I'm, oh wait, I'm gonna shave this a little later this is what it looks like after I've cleaned it up. So you can see, let me step back. It's all clean. There we go. So that's what my desk looks like. So I'm going to clean it up. And then after I clean it up, I'm going to take the flashcards I need to school, which is the biology ones. And then I'm going to continue and get ready for school. I just had a look at the bus time. The bus is in six minutes. So I'm going to try and make that bus the bus. It's about a four minute walk away. So I'm going to try and leave now and hopefully get to the Seven fifty-nine a.m. I just had a look at the bus time and the bus is in one minute so I'm just trying to keep an eye on it but as I said earlier today I had I have maths and biology today okay so I'm back I'm going to tell how my exams went so first of all I had biology which was an hour and ten minutes long yes hour and ten minutes long so some of the stuff that I revised I actually did come up but then it started asking about like the nervous system and like the purpose of sensory neurons and synapses and we, we've learned that before so I was like yeah that's all right but I didn't really revise that that much so I wasn't that confident in it but the first part of the paper asks about like magnification stuff like that I was I was confident on that and like cells and you had to convert the units and stuff so I was confident in that the sixth marker was the sixth marker was about like an STI and like how it's transmitted and it asks um, how is it transmitted how can it be prevented and why it's important to reduce the number of people so I was quite confident with that one and I had enough time to properly fully finish the paper and everything so that's good tried using keywords where I could and then some of them some of the questions what was, one of the questions asks about vaccination and I just spoke about like memory lymphocytes that sort of stuff so that was biology out of 10 i would probably give it about maybe a six or a seven not too sure but then maths like a lot of the stuff i revised actually came up on maths and i was so happy when i saw the paper i fully understood the questions so the first questions they were all right but then the questions like towards the end of the paper you really needed to like apply your knowledge and it wasn't just like a basic straightforward question like there was a five mark question at the back and then there was a question worth two marks so combined together they were worth seven marks so i was all right with that so i finished the paper in about 40 minutes to half an hour and then afterwards i was just stuck on the last question for like a good 20 minutes i was just staring at the question just staring at it staring at it staring at it trying to think of like anything and then finally something came to mind but i don't think I'll, i got the answer correct but i don't think i'll get marks for my working out because my working out was more just like rough notes and scribbles rather than actual proper working out that you would use in a maths exam so maths i would probably give an eight 
out of 10 and I finished it early so the teacher just asked me to check my paper again, checked it again and there was nothing I could improve on. I just felt that was it. So tomorrow I have got English language. Now English language is alright, it's, it's the exam you don't really have to like, you don't really have to revise for it like as much as literature because you don't really... You don't need to remember any quotes for language, but for literature, you need to remember the quotes. And I also have history tomorrow. So history, I'm going to revise history. Just like remember the key key dates and like all the events and like the order that they happened in. And then I'm just going to see how it goes from there. And I'm going to try and like look at some past papers. Well, not really past papers, just like questions that could possibly come up for history. And then for English language... Um, I'm just going to have a look at like some revision notes, trying to remember the techniques, especially for question three, which asks about structure, because I never seem to get that right. And that's really how my revision is going to go. And I've got some noodles and that's what I'm going to be doing.